Tony, my first thought was, yeah, this had to happen. Um, no matter how it happened, whether it was reported as a firing or a resignation or a parting of the ways, it didn't really matter. Because the NFL, which dragged its feet for years, if not decades, before it got to the point of saying, we're, we're not having this. We're going to put in our end zone, end racism, end hate. I mean, the NFL has gotten very loud and in your face about saying, okay, we've joined the fray with other leagues that have been asking for this and demanding it, and we, too, are saying, you can't have this. And then you have this. You have this kind of speech. Yes, it's in the form of emails, but it's speech, and it's ugly, and it's just... I mean, it was so ugly, Tone. And, you know, we, you and I, have a couple of colleagues who told us, you know, in real time, you know, 24, 36 hours earlier... This is who he is. He's a vulgar person, and he did this kind of thing all the time. And while it came as a shock to us and whatever inter interactions, I had more of them with him than you did, it had to happen this way, and it had to happen quickly and now, and then, and then move forward if possible. Yeah, I used the word yesterday about the Demora Smith um, email. I said it was indefensible. I'll just use that same word again today. Yeah. The volume yeah. of this... It, it's completely indefensible, and I agree with you, he had to go. And then I began to think about other issues tied to this. And the first thing I thought about, and Mike, you and I were newspaper reporters for a long time. And that, that gene in us, that newspaper reporter gene, called out to me and said, well, how did this happen? How did this happen? How were these leaks so strategically placed that when the first one didn't get rid of him, the second one, like a time bomb, came out. And these leaks were not to casual sports sites. They were to the Wall Street Journal and the New York Times, which are beyond reproach in terms of reputation. Somebody in the National Football League, not just somebody, maybe more, sat on this for a little while and went to somebody above them, and, and they decided, John Gruden, we're going to get him. We're going to get rid of John Gruden. And there is cause. You and I both agree that there is cause in a circumstance like this. And that was the first thing that I thought of. And the second thing was, what about this team? Go, how is this team going to play? What are, what are the individuals on this team? What are we going to learn about their relationship with John Gruden? What are we going to learn about their relationship with a new coach who, for all I know, is, is a hand-picked assistant of John Gruden? I don't know. I don't know anything about the guy. Are they going to play hard for them? Are they going to win any more games? Or is every individual on that team going to say, just let me get something on tape that shows I'm good and let me get a job next year and let me get out of here. I think we're going to learn a lot down the road. There are 12 yeah. games to go, Mike. Tony, we started, learning, we started learning Sunday when they couldn't catch the ball, the Raiders, against the Bears on a home field after playing well, you know, and winning three out of the first four. We got a, a notion of that. They didn't want to play for him anymore, or at least they were questioning it. And they were in disarray. And so now, yes, we, we find the next step of that. But what else, Tony? John Gruden ain't the only person thinking this stuff and saying this stuff. He's That's not. Right. And That's this investigation right. began with the Washington football team and some behavior that the Washington Post reported in great detail was completely, you talk about unacceptable, what now? Do, you know, there's statements that apparently they're not going back to open it. Well, they didn't have to open it. What about what they found that there was no written report of? What about that? Mike, and so it's just John Mike, Gruden? There's a whole lot of stuff to six, wonder here. 650,000 email. 650,000. <laughs> Got to be something beyond this. Yeah. Got to be yeah, something. You would think so. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.